guys, WWE fans, Hutch here doing another long-awaited unboxing. We haven't done an unboxing for ringside or anything in quite some time, so we got a freaking massive box right here. I have no clue what the hell's in here. I'm excited. Let's get this sucker open. Again, you can go to Ringside Collectibles and use discount code TANNER, T-A-N-N-E-R, all caps, to save 10% at checkout. Um, great deal. Absolutely great deal. Save yourself, save yourself some money. Get all the figures you want. Holy freaking crap. Look at that. This just came in stock. Elite 75. We have a bunch of new characters. Well, I mean, I guess they're not new characters. New gears from characters and stuff. Um, so this is going to be fantastic. So, starting off with Kalisto. This is the last member we need from the Lucha House Party to complete it. The one thing I wish we would have gotten from Mattel is matching Lucha, Lucha House Party gears, but I guess they never really match. Um, so yeah, there's Kalisto. Then we have my first ever Pete Dunn with the new head sculpt and the new gear. And then we have two nice black cats fighting. Jeffrey and the other bigger one, his name is Baby Black. Uh, but we have Pete Dunn in his black and gold gear with the United Kingdom Championship. Very sick. I've been wanting a Pete Dunn for quite some time. Um, and then we have, I, this one means a lot to me because I got to witness him debut this gear live at the Royal Rumble 2018 or 2019 Royal Rumble. The beer, uh, the bears colors. Um, so yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, and then we have the brand new Jeff Hardy. Everybody's giving this Jeff Hardy a bunch of crap, but to be honest, I think this is probably going to be my favorite Jeff Hardy. Um, I, it's just so wacky and weird and all these colors and it's just like the era of Jeff Hardy where he wasn't really matching all the time. He, he, he was wearing random stuff. Okay, that's enough kitties. Enough fighting. Okay, that's enough for you. You stay here. <laughs> Anyways, so yeah, that was just the era of Jeff Hardy where he wasn't like really matching and wearing all the like perfect clean cut gear. He was just like random like tank top and crazy hair and I loved it. Uh, next up we have one of my favorite women in the WWE, Mandy Rose. Looking freaking awesome. Very cool. Probably going to leave this one mint in package because I have the original Mandy Rose. So might as well leave her first ever Elite in the box. So there's that. And then we have uh, my first ever The Hurricane or just Hurricane. I've always wanted a Hurricane. I mean, it's never really been high on my list, but I'm glad to have it because I've never had a Hurricane. And it's an Elite, so I don't think there's ever been an Elite Hurricane. Uh, next up, we have this epic two-pack, Elite two-pack. I love when we get Elite two-packs. We have the WrestleMania moment, Rey Mysterio in his Mysterio attire versus Samoa Joe. And you might be wondering, what's new about this? Well, the Samoa Joe, even though it comes in the same exact body mold, paint, and same paint color has a brand new head sculpt right there with that longish longer hair uh, that we, we've been waiting to get and look at that ginormous chin we're gonna have to take a look at that in the video but that Rey Mysterio I think this is the reason why everybody's getting this is because of that Mysterio Rey Mysterio gear just phenomenal even though this match wasn't that great um, it just it's a phenomenal two-pack so I'm very excited for that oh my god that's gonna fall over whatever Next up, these two also mean a lot to me because I got to see these at the 2019 Ringside Fest. I actually probably touched one of them, I'm not sure. I probably wasn't supposed to. Um, but we have the Shawn Michaels right here. If you go back in my video, I said that this one, out of all the figures at Ringside Fest, was the one I wanted the most. And the one I, if I was offered it, I would take it out of any other figure. And I'm finally, I'm so glad that we finally get this. I believe this is the gear. Uh, he wore during the Montreal screw job. I could, I, I think that's the gear he wore, and probably one of my favorite gears he's ever worn. So Ultimate Edition Shawn Michaels, and then we have the current WWE Champion, Ultimate Edition Brock Lesnar. These two Ultimates. This is probably my favorite series of Ultimates yet. We get three head scans, uh, a brand new Universal Championship. The plates look a little shinier, uh, and then the uh, the strap color is more accurate. Uh, we get three pairs of hands. We get a cloth T-shirt. We get a beanie um, and a whole bunch of other stuff. So freaking crazy! This Brock Lesnar looks phenomenal. Can't wait to get these cracked open. Uh, but get a bet again, guys. You can use discount code Tanner at checkout for Ringside Collectibles to save ten percent at all these new figures in stock at Ringside freaking Collectibles. Freaking insane guys. I am so excited. We're gonna do separate unboxings for these. Um, so 
For this video, uh, I usually do the unboxing and then I unbox all the figures, but for the sake of video and content and ideas, I want to spread things out and make you guys wait a little bit just so you could be surprised and everything. So this will be a separate video. These will be a separate video. And then I'm not sure if I'll do the whole Elite 75 or if I'll do three per video or two per video. So leave it in the comments down below what you want to see. Thanks for watching, guys. WWE Fan Talk Show.